Hey guys, I have already gotten started on supper tonight. I have got um, six, no, seven chicken thighs that I cut up and I've got two pats of butter in the skillet and I'm just kind of going ahead and cooking these a little bit. I've been cooking them for about 10 minutes and I'm gonna cut this stove top eye down to low and I'm gonna add some things to that. And I'm gonna bring you closer so you can see, but before I do that, I wanted to share with you this uh, egg rolls that we get. These are wonderful. This one is chicken and we'll have this with our stir fry. Sometimes I make rice to go with it too, sometimes not. And also I wanted to take a moment and thank all my new followers on Facebook. Thank you so much. I wanna thank all my other followers who have been faithful, some of my top commenters. You guys are great. Um, I've really enjoyed doing this. I am going to go back to work here shortly, and so I hope I continue to do this. Basically, I'm just making our supper, but I am one of those people I can't stand to eat the same thing every night, night after night. So I have quite the collection of recipes, and you know, if I go to church functions, I try my best to get some of those little ladies to give me the recipes. I'm that person. Um, but. I do enjoy sharing with you and um, Lord willing, I'll continue to do that in the future. But I did want to thank everybody, all my followers on YouTube, all my followers on Facebook. But let's go ahead and get started on this stir fry. Again, you will cook your chicken thighs in a couple of pats of butter for about 15 minutes before you add this teriyaki stir fry sauce. This I purchased at Aldi's. I purchased the egg rolls there too, but I only used all together a half a bottle of this teriyaki sauce. If you want to follow along with me, now we are going to add some soy sauce. This is just a guesstimation, but by the time I finish with this, I believe I added around one third cup of soy sauce. My husband and I really like to taste our food. We like spices. So I'm gonna add the Sriracha chili sauce. This is optional. You don't have to do that, but it gives it the best flavor and just a little bit, just a little bit of kick. And I probably added, I'm guessing, a tablespoon or two of that to this. It doesn't take much. Now we're gonna add the vegetables, and I have these Asian seasoned vegetables, frozen vegetables. I added two 12 ounce packs. So that's three cups of vegetables. Let's give this a stir, and then we are going to put the lid on this and let those vegetables steam for about 15 minutes on low heat. These vegetables are frozen, so they are going to add more moisture to your sauce. You will want to make sure to stir this maybe every five minutes or so. Doesn't that look yummy? And it is, it's really good. And if you don't like teriyaki, you can always use a different stir fry sauce, or you can also use the sriracha and soy sauce. You could do that too, but I'm gonna pop these into my air fryer and we're gonna have supper. And I don't think I'm even gonna make rice tonight, but you can have rice with this. It's so delicious. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed that and I hope you have a great evening.